Welcome back to Living Local. The Friends of Longview Park will be holding a frightful fundraiser, Paranormal Night at Longview Park on Friday, June 29th. And here to tell us about it is Holly Sparkman with Friends of Longview Park and Peg Grounds with Whispering Souls Paranormal. Okay, so Peg, tell us a little about, about what about Whispering Souls is about. We are a team that sets out to investigate haunted places to gather evidence to prove or disprove a haunting. Okay, this sounds a little scary. Not really. <laughs> Not really? Okay, okay. And Holly, what, um, is there a sword history of paranormal activity in Longview Park? Um, well, uh, yeah, I hope Peg tells us, you know, <laughs> when we do the event, but we, we kind of thought this is our first fundraiser because um, okay. we're doing, we're working on a lot of projects at Longview Park. Uh, we want to restore the conservatory and then also work on the Lower Lagoon area and restore that as well. So we okay. thought this would be a great fundraiser to have because of the history of Longview Park. And right. um, it used to be a cow pasture uh, hundreds of years ago, but over the course of time, you don't know yeah. of the series of events that have happened. And, and so we're kind of hoping that Peg and Whispering Souls unearth some of that. Yeah, uh, kind of adds a little interesting element. All right, so could you tell us like what's going to be going on at the event, Peg? We will be walking through the park. Um, we will have equipment with us that will pick up any voices, footsteps, anything that comes through. Okay, okay. And have you did something like this before? We haven't done parks, but okay. we have done um, private residences oh, and interesting. public buildings, businesses. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> that would be kind of cool to see, I think. And could you tell us more details about the when, the where, and what people, uh, the timing of everything? Sure. It's uh, Saturday, June 29th at 7 p.m. And um, we're gonna st uh, we have a we're gonna have a little beer garden set up beforehand, okay. um, and then the the tour investigations will start at eight o'clock. Okay. Now, is there a cost for the event? Yeah, it's thirty dollars per person. Okay, per person. And mm -hmm. they come and they stay the whole event and enjoy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Perfect. And now, Peg, this is for a benefit, right? Yes, it is. We like to give back to our community, okay. so when we do anything for a nonprofit organization, 100% of the proceeds go to that organization to help with their projects. Okay, awesome. Kind of like you're taking in and giving back and feeding the community. I like yes. it. It's all around swirl circle. And now Peg, or excuse me, Holly, could you please tell us two more about the most frightening thing that could happen in Longview Park maybe? <laughs> no, I, I'll leave that to you because we, we did like a little test run okay. uh, a couple months ago, mm -hmm. maybe it was, and, and Peg did pick up on oh. uh, a few things. And I was that. by myself walking near one of the buildings and there was footsteps on the gravel behind me oh. and when I looked around there was nobody there. Oh. And as I stopped, the footsteps continued Oh. and then... <laughs> I also, at one point where I was by myself again, I had my name called out. Okay, so for someone who's a scaredy cat like me, like <laughs> what could you maybe like ease their nerves of like coming out to enjoy the event, I say? Just remember that spirits normally aren't what you see on TV. They don't necessarily get violent. They don't attack. Okay. Um, we've never had anybody or anything really get violent with us. Okay, okay. That's a that's a good reminder, I think. I think that'll help people out at home if you want to head out and enjoy this event. Thank you so much for the both of you being here today. And you can find those details on our Facebook as well, and you can also get those details posted on artquadcities.com. 